the energy vibration reading for the Pisces, the Scorpion, Sun, Moon, and Rising sign. Um, wonderful week. I want to say to each and every person, thank you for the positive likes and shares. Um, please thumbs up. Don't forget to listen to your Sun, Moon, and Rising sign. Um, please share these videos and cross watch. The monthly readings are up. So. Go please connect and check out the monthly readings so this week is um, a wonderful week for you guys it's all water over um, it is also your vibrating in um, the zodiac timeline of your birthdays you Scorpio it is a week of Halloween happy birthdays to all you Halloween people happy birthdays Happy birthdays to you, all the wing people. Okay, so let's see what's happening <clears throat> for the Scorpion, Sun, Moon, and Rising. So we're calling in on the angels and guides to show us the energy, pure light, energies of pure light to come in and show us the energy for the Scorpion, Sun, Moon, and Rising. There's a lot of offers that is about to come in for you, Scorpions. Okay, and you have some conflicts happening, and some lies and deceitfulness uh, let's hope that you're not doing this because it's going to be playing back on you okay and that's happening on Halloween <clears throat> that is happening on Halloween so for the people who were born on Halloween be very careful whatever lies and deception is coming to an end ten of ones okay because that's happening on Halloween Wednesday the 10th that's Halloween King of Wands, hmm. Eight of Cups. Okay, there's some a new um, King of Wands. It's like your father is going to get mar get married again, or get married. Or some of you, your father could be getting married, and you could be going. Uh huh. <clears throat> Seven of Pentacles. Your father could be getting married, and you're going. Um, there's a transition that is coming in, but we're going to be looking at that first. We're going to be taking a, a week, a look at your week because some um, transition is coming in. Okay, we're going to be taking a look at your week. So here we go. The energy of the sevens, the sevens are here. Some of you, the energy of the sevens are here. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Energy of the sevens are here. Okay, so there. Monday is going to be a day where <clears throat> you have a um, a situation to deal with a um, Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn man and there's some conflicts okay so if we look there's conflicts there's lies and deception there's conflict there's lies and deception but this is coming to an end there's some conflict some lies and deception but this is coming to an end you have some of you are dealing with um, either a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn in business, or um, just um, either in business or um, in work. It could be a boss, could be a manager, could be someone at, on the work floor. But whether this person is, he's older than you are. Now, you could be hearing that your father is getting married. And your father is going to be getting married on Saturday okay there is some conflicts that is happening because this is the eight of cups some of you are going to decide to move away from this conflicts and this lie and deceive because there is someone who is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn and I'm receiving the feelings of a, a, a Taurus that you're dealing with the Capricorns are going to be getting married. So if your father is a Taurus, Virgo, Virgo or Capricorns, he's going to be getting married. Okay. Um, the Seven of Pentacles is here. And there is some real deception and lies about money in the family. Deception and lies about money in the family. Whatever the lies and deception about money in the family, it's coming to an end. Thursday you are going to be receiving that message it's coming to an end so 
some of you have some new offers that is coming in some of you someone is offering you something okay and some of you are receiving an offer from a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person there is conflicts you could be working for this person because I'm seeing a lot of people around so you could be working for this people it could be a boss it could be um, someone who you're partnered up with in business but there is some conflicts what is this all about what is what is this all about money money it's all about money so some of you could be um, even be stalk or trying to be extort someone wants to extort money from you whoever you are someone is trying to extort money from you he's a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn this man is trying to extort money from you okay I'm seeing that the incident had happened two weeks before that and this man has something to do with this incident if you are a Pisces that was robbed two weeks ago um, go to the police because this the, the person that you're having this uh, um, the person that you're having this conflict with money with is the one who sets up the robbery so some of uh, you scorpions were in business or is a business person or was old up at gunpoint um, the person who did it is the person that you're having conflicts with with money this man is an extortion this man is a thief okay I'm seeing a very deceptive person out there I know where you were born what nationality you are but it's um, <clears throat> whoever the scorpion is you need to um, know what uh, go to the police and let the police know what is happening because the, the person who robbed you two weeks ago is the same person is who is extorting you for the money okay and this person if you don't um, get rid of this person it's gonna cost you your life and your family you need to find in the strength go to the police you don't have to pay this man this man this money okay this man thinks that uh, he's running this mafia thing go to the police okay go to the police because trust me um, they're all he's under surveillance this person okay um, you need to find inner strength with this conflicts and this lies and deception and you need to find inner strength with this conflicts this lies and deception but it's gonna <coughs> over um, and the organization is here um, in reverse the organization is here in reverse because there is really some um, situation that is transpiring around you and you have gotten yourself in this situation whoever you are out there um, you've gotten yourself in this situation some of you could be deciding to um, leave a job or an organization it's as if some of you were the manager for all manage was managing an organization or you were running a department in an organization and there was some lies and deception and you're going to decide to back out and walk away okay let's see what is happening with this man the Taurus Virgo or Capricorn he's distortion you that means he's um, pushing you and pressing you to take money go to the police because the police is already watching this man this man is under the radius of the police I told you I told you I told you I told you the police is justice um, surveillance is uh, um, is watching this man because if you notice how it came right underneath him justice and and surveillance is watching this man and he's seeing the information um, that he's sending to you and the connection that you both have this man is extorting you go to the police he's already on the surveillance this situation um, and you need to go to the police you need to step forward and go to the police because someone has helped you out there was someone that was watching over you has helped you out and uh, the police start to um, look at the situation so um, when the energy of justice comes up because this is powerful this is like the FBI or the CIA is watching this man who is extorting you okay because it's not a it's not an investigator when when is an investigator then it's the page of swords but this is like the CIA and the FBI watching this man okay go to the police if you don't go to the police and make sure that you 
um, the liver and let them know because it's all about money someone is extorting you for money whoever you are whether you're a woman or a man someone out there is extorting you for money you need to stand up and go to the police get some balls get some balls or get some breasts and stand up and go to the police and let the police know what exactly is going on whoever that man is that night of uh, he is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn is on the surveillance okay and it's not like small surveillance it's like heavy surveillance it's like a, the FBI and the CIA and everyone okay and it has to do with um, the princess of ones has to do with the princess of ones um, it could be it have to do with the princess of ones okay some of you people are going to be leaving the princess of ones whoever this princess of ones is there's justice against this princess of ones some of you had a situation to deal with a Taurus no an Aries Leo or Sagittarius between the ages of uh, um, 0 and 45 okay whoever this person is in the weekend um, it's as if you're going to be breaking up with this person whoever she is um, you want to leave her in this weekend okay for whatever the reason is you want to leave her in this weekend which is not being fair and it's not being honest you are not being very honest okay whatever you're going through is um, has nothing to do with this person this person is actually nice to you okay this person is actually a nice person to you it's not being um, honest there's justice that is coming up for some of you some of you were who were dealing with an Aries Leo or Sagittarian a little girl there's some justice that is coming up um, to, um, to you with this person okay this person have done something and um, um, there's some justice that is coming up I'm seeing the energy of the three uh, the eight of cups the eight of cups is that some of you finally 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 and you know um, whoever you are that was dealing with this Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn um, finally is gonna get rid of them finally you're leaving them behind okay and it could be a situation um, finally you're leaving them behind okay um, as I look this conflict some conflicts are there and you're turning your backs this conflicts about money and you're turning your back against this as some conflicts with money and you're turning your back again your back against this and it has to do with some lies and deception it has to do with some lies and deceitfulness and deception now whatever these lies and deceitfulness is it has to do with work it has to be with work and now it's coming to an end the organization is in reverse so <clears throat> it could be an organization at your work that has light and deceitful and the tower is here so there's endings that is coming in your life for you scorpion which is very good some of you are going to receive in some money <clears throat> some of you um, can be receiving some money from um, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn your father or a father figure or um, some money from a lawsuit um, and um, some of you could be receiving that I'm seeing money coming in you're finding the inner strength to deal with a conflict some of you were extorted by someone there was a man and you know some of you got yourself in this if you are a gambler or um, you play bigger than you are or you try to make uh, make things look as if you have it and you play bigger you have cost this on yourself okay you have cost this on yourself whoever you are has cost this on yourself it has to do with a, a friend that a relationship has gone bad and um, this friend um, it has to do with a friend but a relationship has gone bad an uh, invitation is coming in for some of you some of you could be getting um, married or going to a wedding um, there's some conflicts but now um, a friend is going to be inviting you out I'm seeing that some of you between the ages of 25 and 45 wants to end a relationship with this young lady it's not a good idea she's a she's a very good lady okay so an invitation is coming in from a friend for some of you ladies some of you ladies 
uh, and some lucky breaks is going to be coming in for you ladies okay um, lucky breaks are going to be coming in for you ladies this is so good so positive so um, this is good because the tower came out and said that there's a transition and this transition the Sun is going to be coming out there's gonna be some lucky break coming in um, yeah with your um, financial situation some lucky breaks is going to be coming in with money okay here we are having the energy of um, luck new luck is coming in um, new luck is coming in there is someone who is going to become a very good friend um, and I'm seeing an invitation coming in for you ladies okay so this is a really a wonderful week this is really a nice positive week that is coming in and I'm gonna say um, whoever had a conflict with an Aries Leo or Sagittarius she's going to be paying that karma off okay because justice is coming for her whoever is being extorted by someone because um, there's an older man that uh, um, that is extorting you um, it was a friendship that went bad um, uh, he's on the surveillance he's on the surveillance okay he's on the surveillance wonderful energy please light a candle so Wednesday an invitation is going to be coming in for you guys please light a candle ask for either healing or ask for either um, stable and financial balance um, it is and especially for the people who were born on the 29th to the 31st light a candle and say thank you say thank you to the person who helped you to get you out of that situation say thank you to the universe your angels and guides and we're going to be doing the short little prize for you scorpion so here we are calling up on the light beams all the legions of angels light beams guiding angels ascendance master goddesses and goddesses that is coming in for the um, scorpions um, we want to say thank you for all the support that you have done for the scorpions this is just so wonderful that whoever out there that was in um, a situation where someone was extorting them taking their money you finally finally end this situation you finally finally end this situation and this is good okay you finally end the situation and this is good um, you know some of you um, is the third first of the month whoever is born on the 31st of the month you need to take some risk take some risk okay um, because you have um, honesty honesty comes out you need to be honest whoever out there that was born on the 31st you need to be honest um, you need to be honest this is eight honesty is the best policy you need to be honest about the situation honesty is the best policy okay you need to really be honest about the situation honesty is the best um, policy some of you need to take some risk in your life take a risk and go with this little girl because she is going to be much better for you okay whoever you are honesty is the best policy take a risk don't um, turn your back on this little girl because she really cares for you she is going to be helping you also um, so um, take a risk on that um, honesty is the best policy okay so I want to say to each and every person thank you for um, being here please like shares and thumbs up cross watch go and cross watch to see who is this person um, he's a he is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn it could be your father for some of you there's some conflicts this is a family member for some of you this is someone a friendship that has gone bad this person has been extorting you you wanted money it's not nice what you're doing because you're trying to get money from this person it could be a parents and a child situation be careful um, whoever this person is for some of you that is going to affect this person is that this person is on the surveillance okay so be aware of that um, he's on the watch is on the surveillance um, so um, cross watch I'll speak to you guys next week